Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to solve Edexcel International Advanced Level January 2021 Pure Mathematics Paper 2 having a subject code of WMA1201. The PDF of this paper is attached in the description below. So if you want to download it, you can download it from there. So let us start with the first question. The given question is on remainder theorem. There is an equation given a function f of x is equal to x raised to 4 plus ax cubed minus 3x square plus bx plus 5. Where a and b are constants mentioned. When f of x is divided by x plus 1, the remainder is 4. Show that a plus b is equal to minus 1. Here the meaning of the question is if we divide this given f of x by x plus 1 we get a remainder of 4. So the first step which we need to do here is to equate x plus 1 given equal to 0. So we get x value as negative 1. Now if I put x equal to negative 1 in the given function, the remainder should be equal to 4. So probably we are going to write it as f of negative 1 is equal to negative 1 to the power of 4 plus a negative 1 to the power of 3 minus 3. 3, negative 1 to the power of 2 plus b minus 1 plus 5. x plus 1 is not a factor of f of x because if it was a factor of f of x then we were getting the remainder as 0. Since here remainder is 4, x plus 1 is not a factor. It is just going to divide f of x. So what has been given in the question? When f of x is divided by x plus 1, remainder is 4. So whenever I am going to substitute minus 1 here, I should get a remainder of 4. So let us solve this given equation. Negative 1 to the power of 4 is 1. a to the power of a into minus 1 to the power of 3 gives you negative a, then this gives you negative 3, then negative b plus 5 is equal to 4. Further solving it, we get it as 1 minus 3 is minus 2, minus 2 plus 5 is 3. So 3 minus a minus b is equal to 4. Now negative a negative b is equal to 4 minus 3 gives you 1. But they want a plus b equal to negative 1. So we can just simply multiply negative 1 on both sides. Hence we get it as a plus b is equal to negative 1. We have got the answer for part A. Starting with part B, the question given is when f of x is divided by x minus 2, the remainder is negative 23. So again x minus 2 is not a factor of f of x because we are not getting the remainder as 0. We are getting the remainder as minus 23. Again we are going to do the same steps where we are going to take x minus 2 equal to 0. This gives us x value as 2. The meaning stands the same. Whenever I substitute 2 in the given above equation, 2 to the power of 4 plus a into 2 to the power of 3 minus 3 into 2 to the power of 2 plus b into 2 plus 5 
I should get a remainder as minus 23. So let us start solving this given equation. 2 raised to 4 is 16. 2 cube is 8. So it becomes plus 8. 8. 2 raised to 2 is 4. 4 times 3 gives you 12. Plus 2b. Plus 5. Is equal to negative 23. Hence we are going to get it as 8a plus 2b. 16 minus 12 is 4 and 4 plus 5 is 9 plus 9 is equal to negative 23. Finally we get it as 8a plus 2b is equal to minus 23 minus 9 that gives you minus 32. As we can see here all go in the table of 2. So I can just simply divide all the sides by 2 and get it in a simpler way. So we get it as 4a plus b equals minus 16. Now the question is asking us to find the value of a and value of b. From part a as we know we have got a plus b equal to negative 1. We can use here to find out the value of a and b in part b. So we are going to do the simultaneous equation over here a plus b is equal to minus 1. Then we are going to change the signs. This is plus hence it becomes minus. Plus becomes minus. Minus becomes plus. This is the elimination method used here. As we can see plus b and minus b they both get cancelled. 4a minus 1a gives you 3a equals 16 minus 16 plus 1 gives you minus 15. Therefore a value is equal to negative 15 divided by 3 thus giving you negative 5. We have got the value of a. Now you can use either this equation to find the value of b or this equation to find the value of b. Since the second equation is much easier to use, I am going to use the second equation. a plus b is equal to negative 1. a I got it as negative 5 plus b is equal to negative 1. Therefore, b is equal to negative 1 plus 5 gives you Hence, we have got the values of A and values of B. This is the answer for part B.